guys, me host you, Bizarro. Thank you very much for tuning in. Look what I got. It's a box of stuff. <gasps> yeah, buddy. Some more stuff. We're getting lots of stuff at the moment. Now, this little bundle of fun is from Time Travel Toys. Time Travel Toys, they are awesome. They do loose action figures, new action figures. Um, you can get some rarer Hasbro, sorry, like Toy Biz, early Hasbro stuff. Some of the old Marvel Legends you can get from them, as well as a bunch of DC stuff as well. Check them out. I'll leave a link in the description below to their website and social medias. Do check them out. They're all a really good company, and I really enjoy getting stuff from them. Um, this is a box of stuff that I bought from them. And I can't wait to get inside. So, let's undo the box. Yeah, buddy. <clears throat> Nicely packaged. Thank you for that. Ugh. Okay. That return label. So there they are, guys. Time travel toys. Please do check them out on the web, guys. They're on Facebook. And there's a bunch of information for them as well. So please do check them out, guys. Right. Very nicely packaged. So here is one of the boxed ones that I got. Thank you for shipping them so well, guys. I appreciate it. There's one that I've been missing from my collection. Yeah, it's Domino. I'm building up my X-Force. Obviously, I've got Cable. I've got Deadpool. I've got. I've now got Domino. Um, but I did. I've also got um, uh, like some of the other ones, like. Um, I can't think of the names. We, we, we got a bunch of Toy Biz ones the other day. And some of those were, were like X-Force ones. We've got X-23 in our X-Force costume. So I want to do like an X-Force display. So Domino creates her own look with the subconscious ability to predict the success of any given action. Very different looking. This is the comic book version. Obviously the one that most people are now familiar with is the movie version. Uh, they kind of re-envisioned her for the movie. Um, still a classic Domino though to be fair. Just uh, she looks a little bit different. But um, this is the Domino we used to from the Marvel Comics. I will give her a full review, guys, so don't worry about that. I will be reviewing her in full. Uh, so let us know in the comments if that's something you want to see. Okay. Another box figure. So, Time Travel Toys do new and old figures, guys. They do second-hand and brand-new figures. Shatterstar. So I've been wanting Shatterstar for a while. He's another one that's from the X-23 and the X-Men line. Um, I've got most of the ones in that collection now. I've got Colossus, Shatterstar, Polaris, and Wolverine. I just need Sunfire, Cyclops, and Dazzler. Interesting. Uh, I'm not keeping the bath pieces, guys, for Marvel's Warlocks. If anyone's interested in the bath pieces, please let me know. As well, the Sasquatch piece from Domino will be up for grabs as well, because I'm not doing the Sasquatch. And then I've got two loose figures as well. So these are second hand figures. But as you will see, they are very nice. Ooh. Ooh. So this is Kitty Pride from the X-Men lines. I'm really happy to finally have her in the collection. Yeah. I will do a full review of her as well, guys, as well, if you're interested. Oh, she got you. Yeah, she does smell smoke. I was, I was warned by them. Uh, the other contacted me did Time Travel Toys and say that she did smell of, uh, of smoke. She's got the little baby dragon as well. Is that the same one that came with magic? Hmm. So there is Kitty Pride and the dragon's father. But there's Kitty Pride, guys. I've got my Colossus, so I can't wait to pose her with him. Obviously, they were going to get married in the comic books and stuff like that. That whole storyline just finished this summer. 
so I might recreate some of that with the characters it's a very nice figure though very nice indeed what do you think guys? I'm a big fan of that figure the figure's quite, it's not, the figure isn't that loose either she says it's a second hand figure, she's still relatively brand new just that initial smoky smell but we can get rid of that Okay, I'll just show her back in the whole packaging. Oh, I forgot to put the little baby dragon inside. Go, my dragon, go. My X Men collection is getting bigger every day. And then, my second figure is another Nightcrawler figure that I wanted. The only thing missing from this Nightcrawler is his tail, sadly. It didn't come with his tail. Uh, the tail was broken off. It's got a button on the back. It used to do something, this one. That face color looks pretty nice. So here is an old uh, Nightcrawler. I wanted this version of Nightcrawler because it kind of... The costume's kind of in keeping with the yellow and black. So I kind of wanted to keep that. He's a little bit worse for wear. His belt's a little bit broken at the side. That's a pain. That other side has been glued back on. Hmm, he has got a little screw there to unscrew to put a fresh watch battery in. I wonder if it would work if I put a fresh battery in it. I wonder what it'd do. So this is an old Toy Biz one. You can see where the old tail sh uh, completely, completely sheaved off. But I can, completely, I can repaint that, retouch that up, and get that looking brand new again. Yeah, it's an old Toy Biz figure, uh, but it's another Nightcrawler for the collection. I'm still on the hunt for that classic Nightcrawler. I don't, they haven't announced the new Nightcrawler yet, I don't think, have they? So we're still having to make do with the older ones. Still, yeah, still on the hunt for the red, the red and black Nightcrawler. Haven't been able to get get one of those just yet, but I'm still on the lookout. If anybody knows what this electronic part component used to do, because he does have a button, so I'd love to know what he used to do. Did he used to speak or something? Either way, lovely figure. Don't get in my way. something a little bit different there to look at so yeah if you want to see full reviews of these figures guys uh, please let us know in the comments what do you think of the figures I picked up guys are these figures that you would pick up for your collection what do you think of the condition that the second hand figures came in obviously I was made aware, I want to point out I was made aware about the tail and the issues with the figure um, Time Travel Toys are very very um, open about that especially if you're buying online they're very open about that and they will let you know you know if something's awry, awry with the figure um, but they do go to a lot of conventions guys you will have probably bumped into them if you're a convention goer and probably never realised so be on the lookout next time you're at a convention for Time Travel Toys and say hi for me say Super Sorrel sent you <laughs> But guys, which is your favourite figure that I picked up today? Which figure are you looking forward to seeing me review? Let me know in the comments down below. If you enjoyed this video, guys, please smash that subscribe button. It would really support us, it would really help us out, and it would help us keep creating these awesome videos. So thank you very much for watching, guys, and until next time, may the force be with you. Bye!